All right, guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I got a cool one for you today. I got a Factory 5 33 Ford. Now, what's so cool about these cars is basically these drive just like a Cobra, but it looks like a 33 Ford. She's just absolutely beautiful. And of course, she's black, looking good. We got some Resto Mod looking tires on it. Uh, we got an LS1 making the horsepower under the hood. We got a 4L60E transmission. That means you don't have to shift gears. She's a four-speed automatic, so you can get this baby up on the highway and cruise. I mean, just everything about it looks cool, man. I tell you, this is one of those cars that looks fast sitting still. And then that black paint, you want to talk about reflections? She's looking sweet. Everywhere you look, you can see a reflection in that beautiful paint. You can see that the body lines all look good. You can see that LS power plant sticking out through that little uh, teardrop. She's just absolutely gorgeous. And of course, the stance on it too is just beautiful. Those front fenders really help a lot. You don't have to worry about it throwing rocks up or not as many rocks. Open it up, suicide doors on this one. You can see that it's got the four point harness. Now on those harnesses, you can either fasten just the lap belt. You don't have to put the shoulder belts on. You can tuck those in behind the seat. So I'd suggest definitely putting your seat belt on in this car because it's gonna throw you around a little bit. You start taking corners fast, start putting the hammer down. This thing has got some giddy up and go and she's got some traction. I love looking at this thing from the back, the stance on it. It's nice and wide in the back. Of course, it's got that factory five uh, suspension underneath it looking good. And then that black paint, man, you can just see it just, it's just glistening. So you can call Tom anytime at 248-974-9513. He will tell you all about this car because we own this car. We don't do consignment. And then the first thing that we do to every one of them so Tom can answer all your questions is we get them up on the lift and we inspect them. We also take pictures of the bottom side and we do a video of the bottom side. So stick with us, you're gonna see all that in just a minute. All right, it's nasty outside, so we're not driving this beauty in the nasty weather. So we're gonna sit in here. We've already driven it. Um, the mechanics drove it a couple weeks ago when it was nice out. Uh, she drives down the road great. And you can see the dash is looking sweet too. All the gauges we need right here are easy to see. These are the controls for the AC here. Then we got the Sony radio there. You see it all lighting up. Let's see if it lights up there. Maybe not. takes a minute. So we got the uh, the B&M shifter here, the factory five steering wheel that is tilt wheel. Now I'm not exactly a little guy. I'm almost six foot tall, but that's short sure of being six foot tall. And you see, I got a mile of headroom here. I got plenty of leg room down in here. So this is a good choice for a big guy. Um, she drives like she's on rails because it drives just like a Cobra. The frame that's underneath this thing is very close to what they do with the Cobras and the Daytonas and everything. So they know what they're doing when they build these things. Guys, call Tom anytime at 248-974-9513. He'll tell you all about this car. We can help you with financing. We can help you with shipping. We can take care of all that. Call him. He'll take care of you. All right, we're underneath this little street rod now, and i tell you what. It is amazing. Look at all the bracing on this frame, going this way, that way, and every way. Got an 8.8 .8 in there, 323 gear, and it is posy. You can see it's got stainless exhaust on it, all polished up, looking good. And then look at this tubing going in every direction. I mean, this thing looks like a suspension bridge under here. Beautiful work. And then they got these two great big tubes running down the side. Just looking absolutely, I mean, it looks like girders under here. These things are solid as a rock. We've got the four-speed automatic trans in there. 
And then of course we got our LS power up front. You can see those cooler lines for the uh, trans there. Now she does have manual steering going up to that rack and pinion. Everything under here is clean as can be. Of course, disc brakes up front. I forgot to look out back. Yeah, there's disc brakes out back too. Guys will check those all out, make sure they're in good working order. You can see the nose is looking sweet. Now this nose, unfortunately, is pretty close to the ground, so make sure you keep that away from the curbs. Looks like the tires are almost brand new. I see a lot of nipples still on them. I like the way the centers are blacked out, and then the uh, aluminum here is looking sweet. And the size is 255-40-18s. Then look at the reflections in that black paint. Isn't that looking sweet? Looks like we're looking at the back wall. Tell you what, I see one thing right here that doesn't look too good. Oh yeah, that's me. <laughs> hey guys, we got a 295-35-18s out back. Again, same good looking wheel. So we're gonna lower this baby down, raise up the hood, and take it out LS power. All right, we're under the hood here. We got LS1 power, and look how clean everything's looking under here. We got jet coated shorty headers on there. The cold air setup here is looking real nice and neat. We got aluminum radiator in here. And then look at all the engineering down there for that front suspension, man. You want to talk about cool? Absolutely cool as can be. And here's another cool thing. It's got an AC pump on it. That means she's got air conditioning. Serpentine belt setup, late model alternator on there. Just everything about the car is looking sweet. We got the uh, dipstick for the trans right over here. Everything under here looking sweet. You see even the bottom side of the hood's nicely painted. Now this hood's kind of cool. Uh, you see these little pins up here? These little pins slide into these holes right here. So when you put the hood down, you push it back. We got a couple little pieces of felt here that ride on the bottom of the hood. You push it back and then it latches up here in the front. So that latch is in the rocker panel of the driver's right there next underneath the driver's door. You pop this latch, then you pull it forward and then you pull it up. Guys, this is one sweet automobile right here. Factory 5 makes an amazing frame, an amazing body. And of course, we got LS1. You know what that does. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales Park this dream in your driveway.